Friends of the Special Advice on Media and Publicity to President Muhammad Wari organized a farewell party to honor him for his years of service to the nation as he leaves the office for the next dispensation. The event, which was organized in Lagos, witnessed eulogies of Mr. Femi Adeshino from family and friends. Our correspondent, Paul George, was there. Lovable, down-to-earth, conscientious, thoughtful. These are some of the words used to describe Femi Adeshino, the special advisor on media and publicity to President Muhammadu Buhari. In a celebration that is also interactive, questions are thrown at the man they all simply call Femi about his experience in government. May 21, the newspapers just came out, this day particularly, Buhari has been from morning to night, I couldn't I could My phone was ringing fast over, fast over, fast over. He didn't consult me. He didn't ask if I opened it or not. It was out of my hand. <laughs> if I wanted to go now at that point, I couldn't. It's surprising to me. <laughs> I've been in God after eight years, and I have not been in Islam. That shows you the all that stuff. For me, it doesn't make sense. Adeshino, who has been vocal against perceived tantrums thrown at his boss and the administration, gives thanks to God, but is quick to say his principal, President Buhari, detests when lies are in an effort to defend him and his policies. I've never seen it. In eight years in the villa, I didn't see all that Ruben mentioned. I never experienced one of them. But like they say, it's different strokes for different folks. Four years, eight years, there is always a time to return. So don't get to the villa and let it get into your head and you become another person. Remain who you are. The principal I saw, President Muhammad Uwari, does not expect you to lie for him. You'll be surprised if you lie on his behalf. He's the one that will come out one day and expose you. So there is no need to lie. Just say the truth, the whole truth at all times. It was at a huge sacrifice. Well, I'm happy I did it. His friends of many decades recount their experiences with Mr. Adeshino. They say he's a jolly good fellow. When your job is to communicate with the public and to explain the actions of government, um, people who receive that, you have those who are neutral, you have those who have taken sides, and you have those who are for you. You look at what Femi has done, you know, Requi as required of him as a spokesperson. I think he's done very well. He kept his friends, and everyone was here today happily celebrating him as uh, somebody we are proud of for his service to the country. In most climes, especially in Nigeria, you honor people when they come into office because you have expectations of benefiting from whatever largesse they, or patronage that can come out of that relationship. But we are celebrating him when he's going out of office. We are celebrating him that through thick and thin, we are friends, we identify with you. He was a representative of each and every one of us. And I think he acquitted himself very, very well. And we're very proud of his service. When he was in Concord and uh, he had to allow us to have a column on page four for um, what we call uh, much ado about boobs at that time, talking about breast cancer weekly to people. And then the second one was when I was when I was repackaging for Ty Rolling Dollar, the legend, the musician. And he was there for us to celebrate and I thank God for him that he went into that place for eight years and came back with integrity intact. We thank God for him and bless him and we wish him the best. <laughs> Another friend and colleague of Mr. Adeshino, Lekon Ogumbanwo, commends him for meritoriously serving the nation and for being himself. No matter how effective you are, you will leave the office. But if you don't leave the office, the office will leave you. Right? And if you forget all those, your friends, when you come out of that office, thank you for being Femi. Madam, thank you for holding him strong. 
Thank you for giving him rope. <laughs> eh? So say thanks for being your father's daughter. Femi, thank you for making us proud. Femi Adeshino, who wears the officer of the Order of the Niger, OON, is a foremost journalist who has worked in different capacities, both in print and electronic media. He moves to the next phase of his life after the Buhari administration exits on May 29. Paul George, Plus TV News. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.